Hello everyone, welcome back. In this video, we will see how to install NiFi in Windows. So first, let's go to the NiFi download page. Here it will show the releases that has been offered by Apache NiFi till date. And we will download the latest release which is 1.12.1. .1. For Windows, I am going to download the binary zip format so if you click on the binary zip format it will direct us to a mirror site where you can download the file I have already downloaded it and saved it in the folder that's why I'm gonna skip it feel free to download it it will take some time to download I have already downloaded the file and extracted it to the folder to see the folder structure you can go inside the knife file folder and see there is a bin folder where all the executives are there the configuration folder where all the property files are there the docs the extensions which are having the plugin extension and the libraries to start nifi in windows the run underscore nifi dot bed file is needed generally you can start the nifi by double clicking the run dot underscore nifi it will start the nifi at default port which is 8080 port since I have some services running in 8080 port, I will change the port to some other port which is 8181. To change the default port of the NiFi, we need to change that in the NiFi.properties file. Search for in the NiFi.properties file, search for HTTP port. Here I have already changed that from 8080 to 8181. Now go back to the bin folder and start the run uh, the NiFi by double clicking the run underscore NiFi dot bat. While starting, you can see the logs or the processes which are happening under the hood through the log file. So there are three log files, the nifi-app.log, bootstrap.log and user.log. Generally all the processes are happening through the nifi-app.log. So you can have a look here. There are NAR files which are the, essentially the plugins or the processor plugins which are already loaded in, into the nifi folder. So these are getting processed. So it takes a bit of time to start the or a cold start to have a NiFi. So it will take like one minute to start the whole NiFi bundle. Now we can see the logs has been populated and we can see the JT server which is the HTTP server or the web server has already been started. We can go back to the browser and check for the localhost 8181 slash it will direct us to the UI of the NiFi. Here, guys, here is the NiFi. So, here are the processors. You can see a bunch of list of processors which are being used to transform, extract and load the data. Here are the input and output ports. Here are the process group where we can logically group those processors. Here is the remote process group where we can connect to a different NiFi instance and other stuff. Till now we saw how to download, install and start the NiFi on Windows and how to customize the port of the NiFi as well. In the next video, we will go through a rough basic pipeline and implement that with the NiFi processors and connections. Thanks for watching this video and don't forget to subscribe the channel for the new videos. Have a nice day.